got to be it over there. Oh, he's moving fast. So what are we doing out here, Robert? Okay, so we're looking for a cemetery. Okay, now we've been told about this cemetery that it was over here and it had been probably destroyed many years ago by accident. The land has changed ownership several times. The owner that gave us permission he did nothing about it. Yep, did but, not. But we were inquiring with other people that knew about this property and said that someone could have been in here clearing this land off at one time and accidentally, they claim accidentally, but they don't know for sure. They said, come and look. Yep. So we're back here, we're looking and we've got a big open field. Obviously there's been a lot of clearing around here. Yeah. Now, one thing to note, let's read the land a little bit. We've got a bunch of daffodils planted out here. We've got a cedar tree right there. You've got a, a big magnolia tree that someone saved for some reason. And then look, another two huge, a pair of cedar trees. Well, let's go over and look at these cedar trees over here. Nice. Hold on just a second. Hold okay, on just what? a second. I was just looking, I was walking mm -hmm. up behind you. Look at the base of that tree over there. What is that? I don't know, it's too far away for me to look. Let's go over and see. And styrofoam or something? I see white rocks. Go over and look. Oh, he's moving fast. Come here. Oh no, that's it, isn't it? Look, I didn't bring none of my brushes or nothing. Look. We got it. We got it. Oh man, we got it. Oh man. You know, look what I, what I saw was partly a piece of aluminum. Let's dig it out. We'll dig it out. We don't have any tools. You just bring this one out. Yeah. Look, another piece right oh, there. Yeah. I didn't bring a brush. Oh, I got a bandana in my pocket. Okay, you don't need a brush. You need a brush? We need... We need someone to solve a puzzle. What do we need? There's a piece right there. I got writing on this one. This is a big... This is busting. There's some writing right there too. Look, upside down writing. Man, I hope we can get a name off of this. This is this is exactly what it's all about right here. This is why we do this sort of thing. Um, uh, graves get lost. This is the first time we've seen one this dramatically lost. But thankfully, we found some pieces. So we're going to try to put this back together and at least get this recorded that somewhere out here there was a grave. And probably more. Oh, I got right here too. Oh, I got a name. I got a name. What's the name? I can't see. It's I see flashlights. Mary E. Mary E. Is that it right there? Yeah. Is that what it fits? That's it. Sacred to the memory of Mary E. McComb. Comb? McComb. Yeah, M-C-C-O-M-B. We've got another piece. Oh yeah, okay, so this was, you know, I was thinking that this was a flat slab, like no. a tabletop. Pyramidal. This was a headstone. It's a headstone. It was up like that. Okay, Pyramidal. so we're missing. So what is this? This this has nothing. This is just flat. This has nothing. This is the bottom part of the problem. See anything on there? No. The so let's set these over here. Here, hold this. Let me hold the line. Oh, oh, here you go. 
Right yeah, there. I got an epitaph. Hey, come over here a little bit closer. I'm looking for more pieces. It says, but all seasons for thine, O death. So this is Mary E. McComb. Maiden name was, and that's missing. We'll find it. We'll figure it out. I'm in pieces. I'm in pieces here, man. Oh man, when they destroyed this one, they, yeah, they pushed it up in the dirt. Didn't they they really that. destroyed this one. This is right around here underneath our feet, too. You yeah. Know it? I might be, we might be able to get on. We've got our name. We can probably do a Google search and find something. This had writing on it. It does? Check this out. This had writing on it, too. And it looks like Not around here, Robert. So where did it come from? So where did that come from? It was probably broken and pieces fell off. We're gonna search over this way. Things about here from really bad. Found a piece over here, Robert. All the way over here. It's far away. Here's something on here. See if you can puzzle this one in there. It looks like three letters. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go um, here. I'm gonna go look right over here. I see a pile of rocks. Over here. This is, see it's like February, F-E-B, on this one. Wherever this gravestone was, it's been pushed everywhere. Yeah, it's all over the place. Hey, this is uh, come here a second. This is a big old pile of rocks, and we are uh, we're 25 feet away from where Robert's assembling the headstone but there's just a pile of old field rocks. Robert you see this over here? Let's go back over and see what he's found. There's a big pile of field rocks right here. It's been pushed over here too. Okay, yeah. There's nothing in there. I mean we're gonna be out we to lose our lives so it's rocks. Nothing that's not part of the grave marker, is it? What are you looking for? I just saw these lines going through it, but I think that's just natural stone. Mm. So I found a piece way over there, so it could be something scattered everywhere. Someone came in here and did some work on this land. Yeah, so these are all the pieces that we found. And there's, there's no telling where the original burial was if it was not those indentations we saw over there. But we've got sacred, sacred to the memory of Mary E. 
in, it looks like, Macomb. It says, maiden name was, and then we've got something missing there. But, hold that, Robert. We do have some more pieces here that look like, no. So see, I didn't know if this may have been from a different stone right here, because okay. look, you've got M right there, then B. That looks like a stylized B for born, February 1st, and then, what do we got right there? Out. January. J A N no. Departed. That's what that is. Departed this life. So and we've got February looks like letter N right there. Above the epitaph. So we could have is this thicker than this? No, it's the same. It's about the same. What is this? Did you try reading this yet? Yeah, I did. It says, um, but all, all seasons for thine, for thine one, O death. So is that February piece not match that February piece? Where, 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 where? Well, we've got February right here, F-E-B, but it's yeah. hard to say whether it matches or not. Because it almost looks like an edge. Just small pieces missing right here? Yeah. Yeah. How does that look? Shine your light on there and see if it, that looks like it's bring the water. Yeah, the writing looks close. The yeah. engraving is about the same depth. So That's probably this depth. is all. But I mean, surely she wasn't out here by herself. No, 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 no. This is there was a cemetery here. Where we don't know. Now, we found the debris here, there. It's like I said, someone bought the land and cleared it off. We see some piles over there, debris. Yeah, I looked through those. I didn't see any. It could be buried underneath that debris. Yeah. If someone was in there with a bulldozer or something, bulldozing this land off, and they pushed all this stuff up, no telling where the rest of this could be, and no telling where it came from. Uh, we're, we're in a grove. This is a grove, isn't it? Yeah. This is a grove, these trees. Pecan trees? Old pecan trees? Yep. So if you had a pecan grove, you wouldn't keep a magnolia and some cedar trees in there. Uh -uh. So I don't think the cemetery was there. I think the cemetery was over there where we saw those cedar trees. I agree. And Probably. Bulldozed them. Whoever came in here at one time, bulldozed this stuff up, didn't know what they were doing, wasn't paying attention. Uh, and that's, that's what's left of us here. All right, guys. Well, we kind of kind of completed our mission out here today. We found at least one of these destroyed graves out here. Uh, again, we were told that there used to be a cemetery here. Uh, don't know anything about it, but that somebody accidentally destroyed these graves a long time ago. So we were able to piece this stone back together and actually get a name off of it, Mary McComb. And uh, so she's been forgotten for a long time. So it's kind of nice to have a name again. Um, we're gonna try to do some research about her. Of course, it's gonna be kind of hard with no death date or birth date. We do know it looks like she was born in February, so that gives us kind of an idea. But I think this is this is really incredible, and this is really what it's all about, this preservation. This is why we film these graves while they are while they're not destroyed, before they get destroyed, before this history yeah. gets lost. This is this is what it's all about. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Yep.